Hello everyone! Today I show you my budget Atlantic old school deck Ernamgeddon. His deck is a midrange with little bit of combo elements and it contains a lot of the best green or white cards. The deck's names contains information about most important cards Ernamjin and Tarmageddon. It's main idea of the deck fast put into play the best green creature in old school then destroy all lands with Armageddon and don't give opponent chance to come back. To make Armageddon's effect more one-sided we use Birds of Paradise, Land of Our Elves, Soul Ring and Land Tax. Birds and Ring can give a mana and don't die by Armageddon. Tax draw a land from the deck at regular and help you don't skip land drops. Also Land Tax work well with Silver Library, our second card advantage maker. With these two in the board, we can look at top cards, take not actual to top deck and shuffle him into deck at the next upkeep. Jin is really cool, but he can do all jobs alone. Also deck contains the best white creature, Sarah Angel. In most Ernamgeddon versions you can see more big creatures. His list is budget, have not moxons and can't put big treats into play fast. So we use cheap aggressive creatures here. It's Savannah Lions and Dryads. To remove artifacts, creatures and enchantments, deck use best white removal spells. Swords to plow shares, disenchant and balance. Sometimes use the balance in deck with mana dorks not very easy, but it's still overpowered effect. A last spell in the deck is Regrows, Green Demonic Tutor that helps you use any card that you played in the game before. Mana base contains one strip mine, because everyone in Atlantic use one strip mine, four copies of City of Brass, because I have not summoned this, and lots of basic lands. It's important to put many basic lands in the deck for upgrade and tax effect. Now let's look at the sideboard. Here we have Circle of Protection Red for aggressive red decks, Irling Dervish and Karma for popular mono black decks. Jalum Tom for control decks, Tsunami for control decks too, but mostly for the deck. In this case, it's one sided Tarmagan. Wrath of God for some heretics, and Dust to Dust for everyone who have Moxons. If in your playing group many players use Moxons, it's better to put Dust in the main deck. You have only 3 lives and your opponent cast lightning bolt too. Now you can play your source to plot shares into one of your creatures and gain life. Resolve bolt and green life. Good. We give our first walk to opponent creature. But need to block him, so we play Armageddon and destroy all our basic lands. Now we have not forest and can block him. We have 7 cards in hand, but we want to use land tax. So we can find only, only one basic land. It's forest. Put it into hand, draw a card. Play land. And we have exactly 7 cards again, don't need to discard. We can found not 3 cards. Opponent have 2 creatures, big creatures and we have balance, but have 2 birds of paradise. We can just block something, lose the birds, and play balance to destroy our table. We have Sylvan Library and Tax. And draw extra cards, looking into free with Sylvan Library after search. One, two, three. Oh, it's really bad. Don't need them. There are one. Put another into the deck. Now at next upkeep, search for this lens. Shuffle deck. Okay. 
and look at you. Sword, sword, and the belt. It's good. Better than three basics. And it's all. If you like this video or this deck, press the like button and follow my channel to don't skip next video. Thanks for the watchings and see you next week.